Hey guys, this is Icy Hate, and uh, today we're going to be doing another um, water mod tutorial. <coughs> First, get a pallet. I put it at a like like a 90 degree or a 45 degree angle, and um, we're gonna make a temporary circuit. So, get an unpad input. So, to any key, I have it set to KP5. Put it down, and then scroll through and get a GPS, and put that on the ground. Then we're gonna wire the store safe position to the out, and I'm gonna get my debugger, put it there. And as you can see in the upper right or upper left corner, you see a zero right now. When I do this and press, it will save a position there. Save a position there. Save a position there. And save a position there. Then bring this back. And you can now delete your numpad input. Now we're gonna get a. Let's check. Yep. We're gonna get a, another numpad input. I'm gonna set it to one. And just place it there. Then we're gonna wire uh, next to the out. Uh, and then we're gonna wire. Then we're gonna get a gate, entity gates, aim direction. Place that there. Then we're gonna get another. We're gonna get an owner gate. Place that there. And as you can see, this is pretty similar to my last video. We hook that up to there. Then we get another cam controller and we throw it right in the center. And we get position from the recall vector. And we get the direction from the aim direction vector. And then we get we go get gates. We get a whoops. I don't know. Then we go get another numpad input. I'll set the KP5 and toggle turned on. And then we just activated out. Oh. And now, when you press five, as you can see, we're up in this corner. Press one, we'll go over to this corner. Press one again, we'll go to this corner. Press one again, we'll go over to this corner. Yes, very simple. But we can do a little bit more. Let's uh do a small tutorial on let's go to vector gates and decompose. And we're gonna decompose this vector into three different numbers instead of one vector. Recall vector. Then you get a constant value. Um, set it to let's do 50. Put it off to the side, and then we go to gates, and then we get a smoother from the timer section. We get three smoothers. And we hook smoother A to X, smoother B to Y, smoother C to Z. And we set the rate on all of them to 50. And now we hook up, we get rid of this position, and we get the X. Y, 
Let's see. I press five. Ooh, what is happening? <laughs> Let's change the lag. Holy crap. Let's change something. Uh, constant value. Constant value. Change this to 150. My Z coordinate is wrong. That would probably be why. I'm going to do a little thing to fix that. Okay. There, now we're in the right spot. Now we can change this to, like, let's do 250. And now we're over here. Press 1 again, and it'll tween. <coughs> and this is the tweening observation camera. You can even switch through two. See, right now I'm going to this point, and if I press one re twice really fast, it'll go straight diagonal to the other point. And when I'm in the middle, I can do it one more time, I'll go back to that point. So that's pretty cool. Um, so pretty much you can observe any position from, you know, inside this little radius if you wanted to. Yeah, very cool. Um, so it just pretty much tries to move to the point that you give it, or you direct it to. Uh, I hope you learned something, and uh, thanks.